the one, the only, Ben Sion. Good morning and welcome to Yeshiva YouTube <coughs> Daily Double. Mishnah Yomi, I'll continue with the last parak, parakas. Mishnah is Dal and Hey. Mishnah Dal says, You know, I'm on and I'm on and I'm if you're younger than 13 years old for a boy and 12 years old for a girl, you don't have to fast on Yom Kippur. <clears throat> However, we do teach them, just like all mitzvos she'egil chinuch. This is a mitzvah which the later egil chinuch is hard to train a child, a seven-year-old child, to fast on Yom Kippur. But the years before, the couple years before, you're allowed to mechan chinuch. And the Gemara explains, if the child is a weak kid, it's hard for them to fast. So then you institute chinuch the year before, from 11 years old for a girl, 12 years old, 12 years old for a boy. And if they're strong, then two years before, <coughs> the Gemara says that's only in terms of fasting the whole day. But in terms of um, in terms of doing it shows, meaning if they normally eat breakfast at 9 o'clock, you push it off till 10 o'clock, that you start doing already when they're 9 and 10 years old. The Gemara explains that. It's just like any mitzvah, there's a mitzvah, one of the mitzvahs on the Torah is to fast in Yom Kippur, so therefore you have to train them. Hey, Ubreshe Richa, if a woman who's pregnant, she smells a food on Yom Kippur, we feed her, we let her eat, even though there's no definite cause that she might actually miscarry or be dangerous to her. Uh, we let her eat and we let her eat a lot until she feels better. Chola, because it's a kind of for her and for her child. Chola, machila no al pi If he's a sick person, so and he says he doesn't need to eat, but the but the doctors say he needs to eat. So we feed him based on the doctors. The main sham biki and malchinos al biatzma shiomer die. This is interpreted to mean not that there's no doctors around. The doctors think he doesn't need to eat, but he says I feel like I need to eat. So we listen to him also, right? Levi yodea maras A person knows how bad he's doing, so therefore we listen to him, and we feed him until he says enough. Now it's interesting to know the distinction by a woman that says by a pregnant woman ashtasha nafsha. By men, Ajiomer die. Is there a difference between the two? One is a woman, one is a, a man. I'll talk about the difference between man and woman when it comes to halachas over here about fasting on Yom Kippur. It's a very interesting share. You're going to want to hear this. Ian Metzion coming up next.